Welcome to my art channel. Today I'm going to be drawing a prickly pear cactus with some beautiful vibrant yellow flowers on it. First I'm using my Pintel ink pen to define my sketch that's underneath. I like to define all the edges and start adding some values with my Pintel ink pen. And when I'm done with that I'm going to go back with my Sharpie and I'm going to add some darker values by using hatching marks. In the upper left corner, I've shown you a photo of what the final drawing is gonna look like. Um, there's a lot of saturated uh, colors, uh, some beautiful greens, yellows, and oranges. I'm gonna use some pink as well. And I'll show you later on on how I use my Arteza brush pens to create those vibrant colors. But right now, I'm still adding some details and so adding some darker values uh, before I add the color. Okay, I'm adding colors to the flowers. First, I'm starting out with a light peach, and I'm also going to be using orange, lemon yellow, sunset yellow, and rouge pink. I'm going to be layering lots of colors. The greens that I'm going to be using are parakeet green. I'm also using seaweed green and light green. Um, and it's just really when you are using a color, I do recommend that you pick three um, in the same family, a light, a medium, and a dark. So even with the greens, it looks like it's all one kind of green, but I have a light, a medium, and a dark so that I can achieve those darker values and those lighter values to create the illusion of form and roundness in the cactus uh, parts. Okay, you may notice that I'm taking a paintbrush and a little bit of water and blending. And since the Arteza brush pens are water soluble, and this is true with any kind of water soluble marker, you can take a little bit of water in a brush and do some blending and smoothing out uh, some of the layering that you've done with your colors. Okay, for some final details, I'm using my white gel pen to add some thorns and some highlights and some little details here and there. But I'm almost finished. Um, I'm using my pen again, just some little final details. But here's an up close uh, view of the, the final drawing. And you can see all the tiny little details that I've added in there and all the different kinds of textures. I really hope that you enjoyed watching this video. I hope you learned something today. I hope maybe that you were inspired to create your own art and as always thank you for watching and have a wonderful creative day